one right away. Hey, we just caught up with Rato. Congrats, man. Congrats. Uh, to, look, Rato, tough customer. Very tough. You mm -hmm. came in though, but even if you hit you with, it doesn't look like it phase you, mate. You're, oh, man, you're in check. I'm a good actor, that's why. <laughs> I'm good acting, yeah. You can throw, man. Um, I think it's all the training and all the hard work we did. Uh, Peter? Yeah. Like before the fight though, were you thinking too much? Obviously he's a, he's a power hitter, he's a power puncher. Yeah. How were you feeling going into towards him before the fight? Um, I was a bit um, nervous, fighting a bigger man as well. A different weight class as well. A new weight class for me, but uh, better get back down to 76. <laughs> so what did you come in at tonight? Uh, came in, I'm not sure what I came in tonight, but um, came better up. Uh, Oh, but, 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 but tonight, we were talking about upstairs as well, you look a bit more aggressive. Is it the goatee? Is it the unique? What's going on? You came in there with more aggression tonight. Oh, picking the holes, I guess. Yeah. A lot more patient. And I think I'm um, getting off the rhythm now and uh, of that rookie stage. And, yeah, it's getting into my groove. Well, this thing though, you know, looking at your fight back in the UK on the Joseph Parker on the card, came back, you know, obviously took the win. Since then, you know, you, you took the fight here tonight. What's the, what's the plan for the rest of the year moving forward? Uh, next month, we've got a big fight in uh, Gold Coast against uh, Kerry Foley. A big title fight for two titles, and uh, after that, hopefully, uh, it's another big one. What are your thoughts on the captain? You know, he's a big Aussie player, he talks a big game, he's a good promoter in that sense. But you, you know, you're the key underdog. You obviously want to go there and upset him. Yeah, definitely. Um, we do train to. I'm sick then, definitely. <laughs> but um, yeah, well, um, uh, we're going to have our, uh, our work cut out for us against Foley. It's a tough, tough fighter. Uh, we're ready to be ready. Hey, you look great in there tonight, and obviously, Terry, uh, sorry, Terry, uh, Ke Kerry Foley's a, a tough opponent. Uh, what, what's the date and what's the card on that fight for everyone watching back home? Um, June 15. And are we able to tune on that? Is it going to be on TV yeah. here? Or I think it's going to be on that. Um, it's going to be streamed on the TV. Yeah, the people can watch it there. Yeah, and what were your thoughts too on the other fights? Were you watching any of like Andre Mikhailovich and the, the David Lights? Did you catch those fights? Well, I think I just sat in the changing room. Oh, we a few other fights, a other fights before mine. I was relaxing here until now. <laughs> I've got to ask, so we've got Dominic, um, uh, sorry, yeah, Dominic Brazil tomorrow and Deontay Wada, what's the prediction? Wada all day? Yeah, Wada all day. Once he touches that right hand, oh, then you're gone. <laughs> it's so different from your style though, you know, he's just such a haymaker, crazy thrower. You've got more of a technical boxer. I try to be. <laughs> I try to be, but yeah, once he catches you with that right hand, you're gone. <laughs> and any final shout outs to those watching back home, you know, your family? Boxing gym, uh, any friends of mine? Thanks for a massive shout out to my son, Masi, Daddy loves you. And um, to massive shout out to uh, my boxing club, Hobbito Boxing, and um, all my friends and family, my sponsors, Tricks Ripwell, and um, Lifestyles Massage, and Jason Study, and Good Cuts, Thanks for so Great work,